It's another day, a beautiful morning here in Tropical Paradise. Getting all the go-karts revved up, oiled up, greased up, fueled up for another day of commerce and fun here in Tropical Paradise. What's going on, everyone? My name is Diesel, and I design stuff in City Skylines. Yesterday, we messed around with the go-kart area here. And we also worked on this little holy lag spikes. No. <laughs> it's always when I pop into the game for the first time. Uh, in the day is when it gets to be the worst. Then it gets running a little bit and it feels good. We are uh, we filled in a little bit of this area over here and we still have some more area to fill in as well. What should we do here? What should we do? I say we start up just a little bit of commercial along this line here. As we're getting closer and closer to this uh, area over here, that's when the businesses start coming in coming into play. Indeed. Anything good? Anything good over here? Anything? Anything worthwhile? But we have some fun stuff here, ready and planned. Well, not really, you know, ready. You know what I'm saying? I gotta look for it. Still no UI mod. I don't know how to make one. To be able to search through all these assets fantastically, wonderfully, easily, at all. So now I gotta find it. I got a new asset. The second I can find it, bang, there it is. The Lost Hotel and Casino. It's fantastic. It's made by a uh, by an asset creator called Drosovila. I believe so. Link is in the description below. And since we already have kind of a casino area over here, we're going to pop it down right next to his. This is the same one. Also uh, made by Drosovilas. That's the name up top there. You can see Drosovilas Grand Casino 1.0. He hit me up on uh, YouTube. He was like, yo, man, you make uh, dope videos. And I was like, oh, that's fantastic. He goes, hey, I did that casino and I built another one. Oh, for real? Okay. Well, let's figure out where we can put it then. Hmm. It's going to take up a lot of real estate. So what we're going to have to do is those seagulls, the problem... Space already occupied. Space already occupied. Can we do anything over here? No, we cannot. What about... Hmm. Hmm, hmm. Ka-ka! ka Here's what we're going to do. We're going to move this bad boy. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what! We're going to move that bad boy right there. It's going to take out a couple businesses, but whatever. We're going to take this area right here and we're gonna move that there same thing over here we're gonna take this and move it on the other side the other side of town here hopefully can I even do that sure let's just put some parking right there parking's always good now can I I still can't Place this space already occupied by the road. The road is not liking us here. So, what shall we do? Well, what we're going to do is we're going to have to delete it. Let's delete that. Construction costs. Can we move a little bit closer? To that? Yes, we can. And then we shall take a road, two-lane road, one-way road. Oh, come on, homie. Where you at? Come on. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. Alright, well, looks like that's just going to be a one-way road, then. Not a one- there's not even a one-way road. I'm just going to have to put some offices. Maybe something will grow inside of there. I doubt it. Check it out! The Lost Casino. The only thing I, uh, would say is kind of wonky and kind of bad is that it's the same color same color as his last casino but still pretty dope looking check it out we got fountains we got people chilling we got pools we got fountains we got we got beach chairs no exhaust fumes pretty cool oh no 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 definitely don't want to do that okay let's back up a little bit and I also have something else here too. Somewhere, somewhere in here. Definitely not that. That's that's a giant building. We're not gonna put that there. That would be ridiculous. That, now see, that would be overkill. That would be a little much. A little too much. Too much. Too much. Much too much. 
Let's see what we got going on over here. Uh, no, 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 right, right, right. no, 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 yep, no, no, wrong, no, no! And I'm spent. What's this? What am I doing there? That's the Grand Casino. That's the first one. That's pretty dope. What else do we have here? I know I put it somewhere. See, that's another thing. Uh, a couple people that make assets never really put like where you can find them, which is always a problem, you know. And I forget if it's even if it's a growable building or what have you. And I hope it's not a growable building. I really don't. But because if it's a growable building, then we'll have casinos all over the place, and that's just a, a breeding ground for disaster. It's terrible. It's not good. It's not. It's not good at all. Not. I'm just messing around with my phone, just making sure that it is shut off from text messages and such, making sure the timer's running. So cool. So we got we got some casinos right next to each other, and if any more casino assets come out, we're probably gonna have to move some of this stuff. Have a nice little uh, little strip. See over here, this is the fun time. This is where this is like the the family friendly beach town and resort. Meanwhile, across the lagoon. This is where the high rollers mess around. This is where the people come to play. Got all kinds of beaches, pools, beautiful women, money, things like that. I'm sure there's pl there's plenty of beautiful women over here and beautiful men too. Who knows? Whatever you're into, it's fine. Everyone's gonna be fantastic. Cause this is where the business is. This is where all the money is being spent. Yes. We got the Hard Rock Cafe. All kinds of fun. So. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The lag. For real. For real, dude. The lag. Really? 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 Here we go. Now, I was planning on placing a couple different skyscrapers here. And I'm going to continue doing that. I think I'm just going to place one more of these bad boys down. And uh, we're going to call it the uh, the area. Central Plaza? Ooh, what's that? Central Plaza, huh? Oh, that's a pretty cool looking building right there. If you ask me, baby. Oh, that's pretty fly looking, man. The antenna gets cut off. But whatever. I don't think that's a real building in real life. Is this real life? I don't think it's a real building in real life, but it has a nice little corner section to it. Hmm. I'm wondering if maybe you can place that here. No, it's just gonna change. So let's put it back here. Good. Good, good. Not enough electricity. That's a lie. There's plenty of electricity around here. I can promise you that. Let's see what we can do in the center section here for the skyscraper buildings. Oh, plenty. But there was one more. There was another one that I was gonna put down here. And Terrace Tower. No, no, no. I'm not gonna do that. That one's a little big as well. Strata Resort. Skyscrapers. I love you. I love the skyscrapers. I love uh, the different assets that people create. It's uh, pretty fantastic. There is a better way to make it look nicer. Better way. There's gotta be a better way. Sears Tower is not going to be going in our city. It's just not. World Finance in Shang. Ah, that's the building I was looking for. The World Finance building in Shanghai. That's what we're going with. And it is a huge building. And it's super cool looking. Look at that. Look at this bad boy. That is an excellent model. Right next to a lot of uh, glass. A lot of reflective stuff. So hopefully when people are flying the helicopters around here, they don't uh, you know run into some, some things. Let's check it on down here. Let's check it on down. Come on. Come on. Can you can you handle it? Can you handle it? Can you handle it there, buddy? Then you have the base. What a little asset. That is one fly ass asset. Asset asset. It's a fly ass asset. Yes. Yes. Alright, well, now it's time to fill this bad boy in. What do you say, folks? What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? Time to skyscraper. There's plenty of uh, skyscrapers that should add plenty of excellent land value. So we should be kicking. We're going to need some parking lots. For parking garages. Yes, parking garages. That's what we'll do. Put some parking garages around here. 
right next to the building before we go ahead and start plopping down so many assets, so little time. And that time thing is a real problem. Indeed. Another parking lot here. Another parking garage. You should be, we should be fine there. We should be fine. Fine. We're good. We're good. Good, good, good. Put some stuff there. Gonna put some buildings here. Some commercial there. And let's just commercial this bad boy up. Ready, set, and here we go. We're just gonna clutter this bad boy in. We're just gonna do it. See what happens. Not sure what's gonna happen, but whatever it is, it's gonna be pretty fly. I'm thinking about leaving this open just in case I uh, feel a little squirrely. Feel like I want to uh, add something else. As a matter of fact, let's add something else. Let's add a road that goes through it. We'll make it squiggly. Try to get it through. And we'll connect that road up right there. Fantastic. Now, is there another building I can put in there? I'm sure there is. I'm sure there's another building I can put in here. I am almost 100% sure of it. Almost, almost 100% sure. Well, Singapore, no, we don't have that now. I don't want to. Nah, 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 not doing that. Not doing that. What are you still, what are you stupid or something? What else we have here? A lot of ugly buildings. Nakatomi Plaza. From Die Hard. No, because then that's just going to breed terrorism, and terrorists are going to come, and they're going to take over. Hans Gruber's going to be coming over here. we have to get John McClane here. And you know what? Not a fan of Bruce Willis, so let's find another building. Now, see, this is pretty cool. But I don't know. I think I'm just adding stuff to add stuff in now, you know? And I don't want to give it that kind of feel, that kind of flow. Stuttgart Tower, no. Stuttgart Times Square Tower already did that over on the other side. I think we'll be all right here for now. And you know, if, if something comes up and I'm like, that would look pretty dope right there in that city, we can just go ahead and throw it in. What's this? It's just a financial thing. Looks pretty cool. Colossal orders offices. Off the Colossal orders offices. Slope too steep, slope too steep. Screw it. I'm just gonna have to do it. Screw it, we're just gonna have to do it in the butt. I mean, uh, hey, haha. <laughs> Let's see what else we got here. Come on, fill that bad boy in, and we'll put some kind of offices there. And we'll dezone those. Okay, so now we're gonna go to the parks area section. We're gonna put in some parks. We'll definitely have to put in the Paradox Park because it's always good for extra big thinkers out there trying to get ahead trying to get ahead in life making that money making that paper making that fly fly moolah Bo show hell yeah now there's a high residential demand because we just put so much so many businesses in here that it's clogging up some real estate so actually what we're gonna do is let's put in a two-lane road to kind of connect through here can we do this Slope too steep. You would tell me that. You would tell me slope too steep. You would say that. And that goes into the highway there. And, uh, I think that's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's amazing. Slope too steep. Can I go the other way, though? Yeah, I can go the other way. So, apparently, the slope isn't too steep. You pain in the ass. Sorry for swearing. But, that's ridiculous. Slope too steep. Slope too steep. Oh, if you go the other way, that's fine. Oh! Let's do it! Now they're gonna need some residential. And we're gonna move some more people into the city, baby. We're just gonna have to do it. The people! They wanna live in the most beautiful city. In all the land, which is tropical paradise. Yes. Let's put in some parks. Some more parks. It's gonna destroy that city there, but that's okay because we're, you know what? Those buildings, they could be small. Everything's gonna be small compared to this humongous these humongous towers so let's fill in everything's filled in good good how about over here see the, th the problem is is that I can't put residential there because if you look at the noise pollution that these things give off it's pretty substantial 
<laughs> it's a little much. Ooh. Ah. That's gonna hurt. But what we can do, now that I just realized something here, what we can do is we can make a road that goes up, goes across, and then down. Pass it all around. Go ahead and pass the duchy. We're not over there. We're not over where we're... Okay, let's knock it over. Let's knock that out. How about the pollution, noise pollution here? Ah, eh, that'll do. And then what we can do, what, 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 what we can do is, let's make a little one-way street going from here down to here. We'll connect them all up, baby. You gotta keep yourself connected. And we're just gonna fill this in to over here, put some offices to get rid of some of the noise pollution from the highway. Fan freaking tastic. Now we're playing with fire right here, baby. I like it. I like it a lot. Let's put some trees. Fill her in. Fill her in there, baby. Fill her in. How's that looking? Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Good, good, good. And let's put some trees in here. Why not? Why not? We have the power, we have the capability. We can make them better, stronger, faster, prettier. Down here, let's get some trees. Super lovely, super nice. Now what about the noise pollution over here? It's pretty harsh. Pretty bad. Yeah. But they're still building those buildings over there. So it's one of the things about City Skylines that a lot of people don't realize. Like, you place down zones and they start building these little tiny buildings. When they're building these, those don't really count until they're fully completed. And that's when the things start, you know, calculating residences uh, in the area. So. How's the police? Fire, police. That tower is not looking too hot right there. That's ridiculous. Now, there's, there is an asset that someone you can download. It's called Superman. It's supposed to put Superman in your city. Uh, it seems like it'd be a good idea. And then you plan it down, and it's just one square, and you're like, oh, man, what, what, what's going on here? What's the deal? And that's when you realize that the asset's broken. There's no Superman. But it does count as a police station, and all of a sudden, it's like a parking lot, and then just cop cars just randomly pop out of it. So it's a one it's a one space police department, which is OP, doesn't add anything to your city unless you just don't want to look at police stations all day. Which I can understand, I suppose. How about the police? See, I mean the police and everything, the fire's good. How about the medical ooh, the medical situation over here is not up to snuff. So let's put a medical clinic here. In case someone gets hurt over at the wonderful Tower of Awesome. Into the wonderful hotels and casinos. This could be a problem, though. Like, this is an issue. Really? Just one... Just one... One lone dude. Do I need to spend more money? Let's spend more money. Why not? Let's spend more money, guys. We have the cash. We have the power. A little police station there in case people get uppity. Look at that. That is nice. Now, what are we going to do? I have a cool asset. I have a lighthouse asset. I don't know where to put it, though. Because, I mean, a lighthouse is supposed to signify, you know, there's ships coming in here and to let people know of the land uh, is here. Like, don't hit, the, don't hit the land. That kind of deal. That kind of looks dumb right there, doesn't it? Not even just kind of. That looks stupid. Just with all those city buildings <laughs> right there in the corner. <laughs> Oh, I'm ridiculous with how I place my cities. Let's just keep that going through there. But check this out. This is a pretty fly asset as well. And it's modular. It's a lighthouse. You can stick it anywhere. You can stick it on the water. What? What? Okay. So let's do it. We're going to stick it right here on the corner. Does it need power? Probably needs power. It's a park. I don't, I don't see how a light... Okay. 
$960 per week. It's supposed to be a tourist attraction. I don't know about the tourist attraction part. But I'll tell you what. We'll connect it up, though. We'll just connect it up. And then let's make a little area over here. Let's make some paths going to it, you know? Can we do that? Is that good? It's good. Little path. And then I suppose we can go... Can we go across here? Make a little pathway going along... Going along, going along the ocean. And connect that all up. So people can visit the lighthouse. Yay. Now I suppose we could throw some trees here too. Gotta make everything pretty. Tap to stop. Little timer going off. To let everyone know, hey, uh, who's, you know, Manning a ship. Just letting you know, guys. See, now the, the cool part would be of this is if it, there was actually like a light in there and we had a night cycle and you could see it go off and you could, even if you could see it move. But still, a very cool asset. Uh, since Lighthouse Rotor Sand. I thought maybe it might have been modeled off of some real lighthouse. It probably is, but there's nothing in the description. Hence, the reason why I can't tell you where it's actually from. So how are we doing over here? How are we doing? How are we doing over here in the financial district? Now, what do financial districts also need? They need taxes. We need to tax the crap out of tax office. Listen, there's two things that are certain in life. One is death. The other is taxes. Collect them taxes, baby. Now, as far as districts go, let's just finish off this district. I guess we can consider this part of that district. Because I don't want to get it mixed up with the sports. We've got this district over here as well. Oh, we haven't even districted this place out? Because it's good to district out your zones. Because then you have different policies that go into place. Like high-tech housing I have for almost every single one of my areas. Whoa, no, I don't want to make a separate one. And what do we call that? What's this place called? High square. Y'all want to get high? Tal, you're the worst character ever. I know. I know. Alright. Now let's make some high residential. Not high residential. Some more residential. Now we're doing some high density residential. Some offices to round out the area. Now how's our travel situation? Not so good over here. So we'll have to make a bus station and extend this area. But so far the financial district will start. Oh, I forgot the most pivotal thing. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. One house isn't on the grid. One thing, one thing. There, ugh. It's the worst. Let's put some commercial here and some stuff in here. Now, our next episode, what we're going to do is we're going to make some walkways and pathways and make this look like it is something that people want to visit and actually live in and work in on a daily basis. We got enough parks and enough parking lots and parking garages. The financial district is looking dope. I'm going to see if I can find a modular asset to stick in the center. I know I have uh, this guy, but you need to stick it close to <laughs> close to a road. Boo. So, I'll have to hunt one down because I think it would be kind of cool to stick something in the center there. Even if it's just, if, if I can find a park that doesn't need to have garbage men get close to it. Speaking of garbage, one last thing. Medical and garbage. Everyone's got the garbage. Everyone's got their garbage clean up. Fantastic. So, folks, a lot of stuff has happened today. Along with the lag spikes. We've got our brand new casino. Competition. It's not really a competition because it's owned by the same guy. Josevilas 
Yeah, the link in the description if you like these assets and if you want to, you know, toil toil around with them. I know I'm probably going to have to change the, uh, I'm going to go into the asset creator and see if I can just change the color a little bit, if I can do that. Because it does look, it's the exact same color. But it's still very cool, very cool asset. Enjoy it. Uh, also enjoyed him popping on, popping on by and seeing the video. I can only imagine what it would be like if I were to stumble upon someone's Let's Play and they were using my map. I'd be like, oh my god, that's so cool, yay, Someone, someone's using it, yay. So... I thought it was very cool, he popped on by my channel, said hi. Not enough educated workers, I believe it. I believe it. It's her. Oof. 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 But it says that everything's cool. Like, not enough educated workers. Guess we're just going to a college university. Or a high school. Let's put a high school. Let's just do it. Let's put a high school right here. Why not? I got enough money. I got enough cash. Folks, my name is Diesel. I design stuff in City Skylines. Tropical Paradise is coming together. We're filling out some stuff. We're making it better for the peoples. We're bringing in more people. And we are also making more commas. Commas? Commerce. Commas? Commerce. Let's check this out. In freeform mode. Ah, yes. Tis very pretty. Nice little skyline backdrop. All these cool skyscrapers in the mix. The seagulls are real. Jeez. So folks, everyone have a good day, afternoon, evening, good night, peace out, like, shout, and I will check you out right here again in Tropico Paradise. Don't forget to pound that like button, and if you want to see how Tropico Paradise comes into play and fills out, and if you want to be a part of the next city that I build, which will be starting this weekend, go ahead and hit subscribe. New videos coming out every single day, every single week. Have a great day. Be cool, baby.